today we're going to talk about the FAA. I know this is an aviation site and you've been waiting to hear more about the FAA. Well, here's what I'm wondering. Why is it such a big deal to help people? I mean, nowadays there's not enough people to help people and there's certainly not enough people uh, out there that want to get involved. So here we are wanting to help. We're a 501c3. We're out there doing what we can to help everybody that we can. And yet you've always got this nagging thing. Are you doing the right thing? Are you cheating? Are you doing something wrong? Just because you want to help people. Well, I'm here to clear that up for you today. Now the FAA is trying to do things that make things a little difficult for you. And I don't think it's one person. You know, government's a big thing. But here's what's happening. If I go out and I cut my dad's grass and he gives me $30 for cutting the grass and then I turn around and I take that $30 and I go flying, I have in essence just broke some rules because I've gotten paid to go flying. And you know, I'm sorry, but if you've been a pilot as long as I have, you know that it's not like this awesome thing the first time you went flying or maybe the first hundred times you went flying. But after a while, this is a lot of work. You're going, you're meeting people, you're doing things, setting it all up. It's an eight hour process just to plan one of these trips. So keeping all that in mind, knowing that I can't cut the grass for my dad and then go flying without feeling like I've just broke a rule, let's just put that behind us. Now God does say that he put these people in charge of the government and we need to pray for them. So let's pray for the FAA. Let's pray that they get these rules down and that everybody who does any kind of flying to help others realizes that if they do it for free, like we do, we don't expect any money from anybody that we help, um, that that in turn means that you're doing the right thing. The day they come and shut us down, from flying people for free, not expecting any money from anybody, only accepting donations um, if and when people feel that they can. So as long as we're doing that, I'm pretty sure the Lord will protect us. And if the Lord's protecting us, no one can stand against us. Now remember, if you'd like to donate, go to pilotsforchristmi.com and there's a donate button there. Please donate if you want to leave a comment or have a question. You can do that on our Facebook. Take care, have a great day, and go cut some grass.